I think that uh, that will certainly vary uh, by user. I don't have a, I don't have a, a hard and fast answer. Um, I think that many companies that have begun to look at Creo are planning between um, a day and a half day of training as it relates to the relates to the to the UI and to get to getting people to adopt it. Um, I think that if you're familiar with Microsoft Office 2007, Microsoft Office 2010, if you've begun to use other applications that have a top-level ribbon bar for command access, uh, you'll pick it up more quickly. I should also point out that command execution, so after you choose to create a particular feature or after you choose to assemble a component, for example, the user interface for performing those kinds of activities, by and large, remains the same, improves slightly in, uh, in some areas. But really, the major change is top-level command access. So once you figure out where things are, you should be up and running pretty quickly. Thank you.